on today's episode of Renegades React. We will be re- reacting to Epic Battles of History. Oh, God. <laughs> Thor versus Zeus. <laughs> that's, that, that's how people are spelling it. Is that how it's spelled in like the Epic Rap Battle thing? I don't know. Let, let's look and see. That's let's not see. how we spell it over here. No, Z E U S. So everyone on here spelled it wrong. <laughs> That's hilarious. Everyone who requested it spelled it wrong. That's why we couldn't find it. Maybe the they just saw one request and they're like, I'll just spell it like oh, that. Oh, yeah, guy. I'll just spell it that way. <laughs> anyway. Okay. Uh, ERB Thor versus Zeus, or Zeus, was requested by Ortiz uh, X- XL15? X115. X115. Yeah. Dask Svim? Yeah, Dask Svim. Dask Svim. And. Yuki, Yuki Yabo. Yuki Yabo? Yeah. Yuki Yabo. Yeah, so, so requested by those three. God. Right. <laughs> oh, man. Let's boogie. Epic Rap Battle Lego Edition. <laughs> yeah, Legos. Couldn't believe it when they released this as Legos. All right, here we go. Battle <laughs> 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 of Legos. That's awesome. <laughs> 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 How dare you challenge my immortal throne? I'm a father of the gods. Put your daddy on the phone. Because when Zeus lets loose, I'll put your cross right to neck in a new. I'm like my goose, so I've shown a mother if he looks at me. I'm a point like both sides and tried it. Ryan's cooler than the frosty balls. Hey, yo, child, I'll torture me taught you. Shape shifting rapist. Ah, yeah. Forrest Whaley. Dang. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, that's that was, crazy. That's some impressive oh, stop motion. Yeah, that's that uh, awesome. that's <clears throat> those yeah, are the guys that, was, that made the That was absolutely fantastic. Yeah, who made, who make the Lego animations. Um Oh my god. Thor all the way, man. Wow. That that's a that is a that was that <laughs> they had three they had three spits a piece. Yeah. They yeah. had three three verses a piece. Dang! I, got, I gotta say, Thor, say, man. like that was pretty close, though. That was like, oh like, my gosh! Because I thought when Odin was, or no, when Zeus was like, "Put your daddy on the phone." That was kind of it for yeah. me. Yeah, and then <laughs> Thor was like, "You shape shifting rapist," and I'm like, <laughs> "Boom!" <laughs> I'm like, "Okay, it's on." <laughs> yeah, okay. Now we gotta fight. <laughs> oh man, yeah, I, I don't know, dude. That was a hard one to call. Both of them made like huge you see we always compliment on what they tie in like for instance you know the greeks you know building the bedrock of uh bedrock of democracy that's why you're going with thor aren't you that's why you're going with thor (laughs) well okay no but to to be fair well the astronomy comment uh yeah the, the, the persians made way more progress in astronomy than the greeks did exactly um the democracy thing it's like 
you, you you can brag about that, but really, like Greek women were treated horribly. Yes, and actually, Norse women uh, they went back and found uh-huh. that about fifty percent of the bodies they dug up on battlefields were in fact w- women. women. Yeah, so you know, so who had the more equal treatment? Right. Uh-huh. I mean, the Norse really were more <clears throat> advanced socially in a lot of ways than people give them. Yeah, and for. plus they did well. They did they they did conquering. You know, they were. You know they were they were vicious. They well, they were conquerors. All ancient cultures did. I well, think. I well yeah they had to, but and mm-hmm. you know discovering that you know the Vikings officially discovered the New World, right? Which which yeah. actually there's yeah they they've said that I I don't know. Take that Cristo Colombo. Yeah, well Chris Cristofo, <laughs> Happy Viking Day. <laughs> oh gosh, now the Italians are gonna hate us now because we bash their hero. <laughs> yeah, the Vikings did it first. Yeah, they did. You got you got to admit that. I mean the the Viking wreckage. Found up in Canada. Uh, I mean, you... you. Mm. Well, but see, that's the thing we all learn in history, too. It's like Christopher yeah. Columbus, like, hero of the Western yeah, world. Yeah, he sailed to the New World, telling Queen Isabella that the world was the world was not flat but round. When Queen, Queen Isabella probably knew they already... They already knew that. Yeah, they, the Dutch invented that. the... Glo- uh, Aristotle figured out the world was round over 2,000 years ago, man. Look, guys, public school in America sucks. Yeah. I don't know if y'all know that or not. Yeah, yeah. The <laughs> public schools here in the United States, it's not it's not print the truth, it's print the legend. Print the propaganda. Print, print the propaganda. Make people stupid. Yeah, I, I don't know. But uh, I don't know, man. I just think that overall, I think uh, I think Thor had more to go on. You think had Thor, Thor mm-hmm. more to go on? Okay. Okay. And eh, what about you, Caleb? Hmm. And I it's mean, still... Pr- Pretty fifty, like I have to give it a little bit to Thor though, just because he kind of underdogged it. Because I would have, I thought Zeus versus Odin would have been a better. Yeah, but I guess that's more me because like they made shots at like the Natalie Portman thing and the, oh, modern, yes. the modern that was good um, Marvel Cinematic Universe. They, they tied in a lot yeah, more they tied than in Zeus a lot. did. You know, Zeus they could have you know they brought in Clash of the Titans, but it was Thor that brought that up. Yeah, Thor brought up Clash of the Titans. And plus, why didn't they like mention you know the Disney version of Hercules? Which actually, I'm pretty sure half the internet would half the internet hates that movie. <laughs> they say it's like the most unbelievably dulling. It's like it's like dulling the edges of a sword. Uh, they say that is the most dulled version of a historical of a historical Disney film ever. Uh, it's just like Pocahontas. At least they at least at least people died. <laughs> at least people died. People did die. Nobody died in, in Hercules. Hey, I'm just saying, when you paint with the colors of the wind, sometimes you got to paint in red. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. But uh, Okay, so you two go with Thor? Going with Thor. I would probably say I have to agree with you. Oh, another shutout. I Thor, mean, shout out for Thor. It's really hard to, to come down on the side of a serial rapist. It's true! A shape-shifting. It, a shape-shifting serial <laughs> rapist. I mean, he did change into an eagle and kidnap Ganymede, <laughs> who was, in fact, a boy. So, yeah. <laughs> it, it, won't get that. <laughs> yeah, it, yeah. It, so, pedophilic shape-shifting rapist? <laughs> yeah. I mean, that's, pretty, that's a pretty that bad rap sheet. That's, that's, a, that's a horrible rap sheet. And considering Thor brought it up, and it's, and it's truth in Greek mythology. It's, just true, it's true in Greek mythology. But yeah, okay. Got it. Got a side with Thor. Okay. So from that's, whence it came. From whence. <laughs> okay. But Zeus right. doesn't need a hammer to throw lightning. Nah, no, he just needs Hephaestus to make the lightning bolts for him. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's true. Okay, so uh, you want to lead us out? Uh, oh, did I? Did yeah, I introduce. I introduced. <laughs> you this let us one? in. Well, thank you for. Suggesting uh, Zeus versus Thor. Uh, if you liked what you saw, click like. If you didn't like it, click like anyway. <laughs> um, stay tuned for more reactions and more. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay.